Hi, I'm Erica from Farmsteady. Today we're making Mexican tapache. This fermented pineapple drink is sweet, sour, and totally delicious. The best part? It uses the parts of the pineapple you don't normally eat, so it's a total bonus. The key to this ferment is pioncillo. This unrefined sugar comes in a cone shape and can be found at Mexican specialty stores and also online and is linked in the description. And if you're looking to ferment even more fruits and veggies, please subscribe to this video, click that bell icon, and you'll be alerted when we come out with new videos. Now let's get started on this tapache. For this recipe, you'll need one pineapple, one cone of pioncillo, a cinnamon stick, and four cloves. Take your pineapple and remove the top. You won't need that at all in this recipe. Then cut off the sides of the pineapple. For tapache, you're just going to ferment the pineapple peels and core, so save the fruit for another use. Add your pineapple peels into the fermenter, the core, and more peels. Then add your sugar. You don't need to dissolve this ahead of time. It'll dissolve on its own. Add your spices. and then top with water. Now just cover with some cloth, secure with a rubber band, and it's ready to ferment. After fermenting for just two to three days, your tapache is ready to drink. We drink it straight over ice, mixed into a cocktail, or even cut with a beer. It's delicious. We're keeping our fermenters full with new batches of kraut, kimchi, kombucha, fermented hot sauce, and more. So please subscribe to this channel, like this video, and let me know in the comments what you want to see next. Happy fermenting!